Hi, I'm Rasheem McKinney, and with the help of Russell Smith, it's our pleasure to present to you um, a brief introduction to the Hoffman Construction Company and the Oregon Health Science Center for Health and Healing. Let's get started with the Hoffman Construction Company. The Hoffman Construction Company was founded in 1921 by L.H. Hoffman. Hoffman was an architect trained at Harvard University who had a rich history in the Portland area. His father had been a construction professional and had built bridges in the Portland area in the late 1800s. Hoffman's company played a key role in Portland's building boom in the 1920s as the city transformed itself from a riverbank town and shopping port to a modern metropolis with high-rise buildings, garages, theaters, and elegant retail stores. By 1927, just six years after being founded, Hoffman's company had more than 400 employees and a payroll of $30,000 a month. Hoffman built upon these early successes and continued to grow the company by diversifying its product types, its breadth, and its reach touching iconic buildings all over the Seattle and Portland area and beyond. From museums to hotels to stadiums to heavy industrial, you name it, Hoffman would build it. Today, Hoffman Construction is a top builder in the United States, maintains a global presence and is an absolute powerhouse within the Portland area. With annual volume of over $2 billion and a reputation for taking on the toughest and most difficult, technically challenging projects. One such project is Oregon Health Science University's Center for Health and Healing South. OHSU, the project sponsor, has a rich and interesting history. It is currently situated on what was to be a large train station, which was purchased sight unseen, only to realize that the land was too steep to operate trains upon. Today, OSHU is the state of Oregon's only public health and research university. It is a unique resource for Oregonians and the place where healing, teaching, and discovery come together. Oregon's Health Science University's the Center for Health and Healing South Building Project is a $349 million, 750,000 square foot building project that comprises two buildings a 14-story healthcare facility and a 10-story mixed-use building that includes a patient guest house construction began in January of 2015. Let's take a closer look. The first seven floors of the healthcare facility notated block 29 below will be dedicated to invasive surgeries and procedural care. Above it the Knight Cancer Institute will consolidate outpatient clinics, infusion, and clinical trial space. The mixed-use building, notated at Block 28, will include five floors of temporary lodging for patient families who travel long distances to access OHSU's specialized services, conference facilities, and above-ground parking. Some highlights for the facility include, for healthcare side, clinical space for the Digestive Health Center and preoperative medicine clinic, a retail pharmacy, lab services, healthy food options, and open wedding spaces and access to outdoor terraces. Guest house building has 76 units, laundry facilities on each floor, exercise space, and a conference center. The primary material for the Center for Health and Healing South will be a glass curtain wall system 
and varying patterns. At the podium level, facing the part, the glass will be fritted with a pattern based on the genome sequence. Secondary materials will include metal louvers and aluminum panels. Materials proposed for the Block 28 structure include form metal panels and aluminum composite material panels, as well as aluminum fans at the garage. Storefront glazing will be used at the ground floor and fiberglass windows at the residential units. We hope this brief introduction to the Hoffman Construction Company and OHSU's Center for Health and Healing has been informative. We look forward to seeing you all in Portland and learning more about each of these very interesting sites. Until then, Godspeed.